Hi, my name is Paril Jain and I'm a master's student in the Embedded Systems program at University of Pennsylvania. Hi, my name is Nishchit and I'm pursuing master's in Embedded Systems here at the University of Pennsylvania. Our main goal behind joining grad school was to be a part of the Department of Autonomy and learn how to build safe and reliable autonomous systems. The Embedded Systems Master's program provided us really awesome flexibility around catering our masters around their interests. Uh, when we joined Penn, we came here a week before our college started and approached Professor Rahul Mangaram describing our interests. He gave us a really awesome problem statement around building and designing algorithms around autonomous race cars. So we developed the chassis for this platform for the same. It is based on a Traxxas rally car platform. It consists of a lot of sensors, controls and actuators. This, the brain of the system is the NVIDIA Jetson board. It is connected to a post of peripherals along it. We, evaluate, we use this system to evaluate perception planning and control algorithms along with coordination. The first step of this entire pipeline is perception. We use RGB images data from the cameras. The laser range finder gives us a 2D map of obstacles around it and the IMU gives us the orientation of the vehicle. We use this information to generate a map of the surroundings as the vehicle moves through the environment. Once we have the map, the next part is to plan where we need to go. We have an initial position and we have a final position. The objective is to get to that as fast as possible. Based on the trajectories provided by the planner and an accurate car model representing its dynamics, the vehicle needs to decide and translate the high level commands to the lower level signals for the drive motors. There are a lot more challenging pro problems when you move towards the multi-robot environment where you have multiple cars racing and you need to design accurate trajectories and solve the problems around overtaking. This project also allowed us to travel a lot around the country. We showcased it in many events including the Real-Time Systems Symposium at San Antonio, Embedded Systems Week at Pittsburgh and the Cyber Physical Systems Week at Vienna. We also held the first inaugural F110 Autonomous Racing Competition where six teams from different universities built their algorithms on the same platform and we had a lot of fun racing them together. We have also developed an online course around this platform for anyone to build, drive and race their own autonomous race cars. This platform really helped us hone our skills on perception, planning and control for autonomous vehicles. And now I will be joining NVIDIA with their autonomous driving team as a full-time engineer. After graduation, I'll be working at Tesla full-time as a firmware developer with the Drive Inverter team. And I'm ready. And I'm ready.